number three is exaggerate your movements. So when I'm working with students, sometimes I'll see this happen. When I, white over blue, blue under white, pinch, pinch, pull tight. So I make them do it again. I'll say shoelace, shoelace, white over blue, making sure that they get that movement and that shoelace over the toe. Blue under white, pinch, pinch, pull tight. So that's the first exaggerated movement is typically the white over the blue. The second common exaggerated movement I have to make is the bear hug. So after making the first bunny ear, if I say wrap around, this is what happens. I get a lot of this and it just slides right over. But if I say big bear hug and I go nice and slow, then it ensures that it circles the bunny ear. Now what happens is if they leave this big circle right here and go to the next step, which is the poke through, then the lace comes right on through there. So after they do their big bear hug, I point out, oh, that's a big circle. We need a small circle. So let's pull it tight. And then when they have a small circle, they can do the poke through and pull tight.